when electrons flow through a circuit that is called current flow and current flow is similar to gallons per second of water which flows through our pipe um, the pressure or voltage behind that is what pushes the current through a conductor so in this example let us find out what the voltage is uh, we have a resistance of 3 ohms from the bulb and we have a measured current flow of 4 amps so using the lower half of the formula we multiply 4 amps times 3 ohms of resistance and we will see that we have a total of 12 volts dropped across our bulb. The most important factor here is electricity always takes the path of least resistance so if there's a easier way to get around something electricity is going to follow that method. Before we look at voltage in a series circuit let's review what resistance is again. <clears throat> resistance is opposition to current flow and therefore the greater the value of the resistor the higher the pressure or voltage drop across that resistor. It is important to understand how to convert units of measure because the service manual may display it in a, in a unit which is different than what your digital multimeter will produce. So let's give an example here. Um, as, the co as the current flows through the coil it pushes open a pintle against spring tension and then allows fuel to flow out of the injector and into the cylinder. 